Hey guys, I just want to give you a quick heads up to let all of you guys know not to forage this plant right here. This is called white snake root. This plant is extremely poisonous. It contains a compound of toxins that's known as trimetol. This plant causes milk sickness, and this is the plant that killed Abraham Lincoln's mother. Foraging livestock and grazing livestock have oftentimes consumed this plant. In the 18th and 19th century, this plant has killed thousands of people. Milk sickness will cause things from paralysis, trembling, fevers, and a bunch of other very, very nasty things. You definitely do not want to consume this plant. You do not want to forage this plant at all. Some people will confuse it with bone set later in the year because the flower clusters look similar. However, the growth structure of the leaves and the rest of the plant, they look nothing like bone set. So let's take a little bit of a closer look to get an idea of what these leaves and stems actually look like. Here from the side view, we can see the opposite leaf structure of these stems and of these leaves. We can also notice that the lower branch will always be horizontal. It will grow parallel to the ground in this horizontal line. This makes it really easy to differentiate from bone set because bone set has perfoliate leaves, which mean they wrap around the stem or the stem goes through the leaves. Whereas on this plant, there's leaf stems or petioles that the leaves actually attach to. So make sure you keep that in mind. So let's take a look at the leaves. If we look at the leaves of white snake root, we're going to notice that the margins have these fine teeth running along the sides, and we're also going to notice this very long, elongated lant shape that these leaves have. This is a lot different from bone set because bone set is a very hairy plant, and its leaves are much longer. They're not near as broad at the base as they are on white snake root. Whenever we look at the stem very closely on white snake root, we can see these fine little hairs running along the length of the stem, whereas bone set is extremely hairy, not just slightly hairy like we can see on this snake root. The stem is round. There's no other discerning features of its stem. It's round. It's very stiff. It feels sort of woody in the hands when you try to pinch it. You can't really pinch it because it's so stiff and solid. Here we can see this opposite leafing pattern with these other leaves growing out of the nodes right here. So this is just a really quick heads up, so that way all of you guys know not to forage this plant, because the last thing I want is anyone to get sick or die from eating the wrong plant. I thank all of you guys for watching. I hope you learned a little bit of something, and if you want to learn more about wild edibles or medicinal plants, please make sure to subscribe.